hey hi guys welcome to my channel so today we're going to create a ipm cloud account i get a lot of questions regarding ipm cloud i mean how i can create an account is it really a free account do i need to have a credit card in place is there an expiry to this account so we're going to answer all of these questions in today's video and we're going to straight away start creating a cloud account so what i did was i have gone to cloud.ipm.com as you can see so what i need to do is click on create an account when i click on create an account so this is the account information what i need to provide so in this case i'm gonna use our channels id so that's tech on clouds at gmail.com i'm gonna put some password i mean obviously it's gonna verify if this is already present so once it's verified, I'm going to put on my password and uh, obviously there are few conditions like it should be between 8 to 31 characters, one uppercase, one lowercase, one number and one special character. So I think one of the things that's missing right now. So I'm going to try again. All right. So once that's done, I'm going to click on verify. So Ideally, I should be getting up my seven digit verification code on my email ID. So let me quickly check for that. So as you can see, I already got my mail. So this is my seven digit verification code. And I'm gonna go on next. I'm gonna put some personal information here. Uh, for example, this is gonna be a tech on clouds video. So I'm going to put first name, last name is tech and cloud, the country, click on next. And at the end of the day, if you want to choose how IBM might contact you by email or phone number, then you can choose that or else you can just click on create an account. That's it. As you can see, my IBM cloud account is created. Now you might have few questions regarding if it's a free account, is there any limitations to it? I mean, is there an expiry date to this account? And did I really add my credit card? So as you as you have already seen, I have not added my credit card to this one. So it's really a free account where anybody can go here and try out a few of the benefits. Mm -hmm. So one of the good part about IBM Cloud account is it provides you something called as a light account. Now, what is a light account? This is something we're gonna see in the catalog. Uh, probably in the next few videos, I'm gonna explain more details regarding what a light account actually is. But if you, if you come to the catalog, I would be able to access pretty much most of the services where they do have a light plan. So for example, if I'm going to search for light, which is LITE, and I'm going to see what all the services I'm having access right now, which I can use it. So this is how you can create a IBM cloud account. And as you can see, this is a free account, which is free forever. But the good part about this is, I mean, you can leverage most of the services which is which is under the free plan which is called as light and you can start building on ibm cloud so in the next video probably we're going to see more details about you know how you can leverage light accounts what are the limitations on the light accounts and obviously we can start building our first application with respect to ibm cloud thanks for watching see you in the next video